All right, everybody. I think you should already be here able to hear me. Just sending out the stream to the social media and then we're ready to go. I'm not sure if I need 36 more seconds on the countdown. I don't think I will. Uh, although I did forget the godlike sunglasses, but maybe maybe we don't need them today. Maybe we're just gonna be super bad. Who knows? <laughs> I'm probably going to suck. No godlike sunglasses. I can never achieve a godlike. What am I gonna do this stream? Oh my god. <laughs> uh oh, that reminds me of something. The words OMG. Gonna have to talk to you about, some about something. All right, so. Making that a bit quieter. Alrighty. What's up, friends of the good mood? This is Manny, and welcome to the next live stream here in War Robots with uh, a lot of stuff that I want to show you. Something, something I haven't yet shown you, and it's this: the overdrive unit. Something that um, that has, I think, entered the game with a 6.0 update. So far, I've been stuck with other things, but now I want to show this to you guys. And basically, what this module does, okay, for those who haven't yet, uh, you know, seen it or heard about it, um, basically, it adds 25% more damage to your robot out damage output um, one of them all right but you can stack them you can have three of them but it's same like it's like last stand um, where there's a certain damage threshold that you have to receive you have to receive a certain amount of damage in order for this to to, to proc and then from this point on you get 25% more damage but now you can add three of them to get 75% more damage output and uh, the damage threshold also goes up so after taking like 20% of damage you'll do 75% and it's actually 85% with Adrian Pilot um, and also the booster of 5% more so uh, yeah let's go and do that ladies and gentlemen we have this on the behemoth we have it on the um, on the Ravana two times, and we have it on the on the Aochun <laughs> with three of them on the Aochun with the one hit killer redeemers. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is going to be pretty Im amazing, and I may regret not having the godlike sunglasses on. Uh, but what the heck? Let's jump into some battle and have some fun. Welcome everybody, and thanks for joining us here during the live stream. It's already a thousand four hundred people and haven't even begun. And um, so, let's first go with the Ravana. We only have two of those modules installed, which means we have to take about. You need. You see, on the upper left, we have to take about forty percent damage, and then it will activate. And once it passes, these little white dish arrow things from that moment on oh well, well, well he wants to get that beacon but I stepped on it and I didn't give it to him from this moment on we're gonna be able to um okay uh, but right now we're not dealing more damage okay right now gotta have to make it a bit quieter otherwise I'm streaming um we have to take a little bit more damage and I'm already seeing the donations popping in, guys. I love you. But give me a moment before we start to go with the donation stuff. I want to first, uh, you know, cover a bit of the, the news uh, in regards to these new modules, all right? So he's going to fire now. There it is. We have a Ravana coming in. He's flying immediately. Okay. Let's... Uh, oh, I'm suppressed right now. All right. No more suppression for me here at this moment. I think he's going to fly any moment now. I'm suppressed again. I won't be capturing this beacon any moment, anytime soon, because, you know. All right, here we go. We still haven't taken the necessary amount of damage. Now we have. Now we have taken more than the damage amount. So from this point on, we're gonna do 50% more damage. But I've already sustained so much damage that basically, oh boy. Okay, here comes his shield. How many people are there? They're all shooting me. Like seriously, that many of you? Nice, okay, this guy's done. Now here comes the Ravana. Unfortunately, they can always just spawn right here in front of us. This guy's also done, all right. We are still doing the 50% more damage. 50% because it's actually 60 with the booster and everything. Um, but we're actually doing about, hold on. Ooh, I'm almost done, dude. I'm almost killed. But look how much I've been doing here uh, in this in these couple of seconds. All right, so that was just two modules. 
imagine how this would look like with three, all right? And this is what the behemoth has. You see the, the, uh, the th threshold has risen and it's now higher. So we should be getting the damage boost sooner. We don't have to take as much damage before it will happen. Okay, so first we have to find a way to take damage. That shouldn't be too difficult, should it? I don't think taking damage is going to be particularly hard to pull off. There is the enemy. There he is. Okay, he's going to start shooting us now. That's good. Come on. A little bit more, dude. A little bit more. I need some more damage from you. Hey! What the ya? How do you th stop? He just stopped shooting me. You don't stop. Come on. Give me some more damage, please, sir. Okay, then maybe someone else is going to help me out. We're still having getting donations, by the way. Is someone please kind enough to give me a bit of damage output here? Double Come on! <laughs> no one shoot- I'm sitting here with a freaking behemoth. Super slow. Come on, you there. Oh no, that's not good. That- oh, oh, hey, 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 hey. A little bit more, please. I need a bit more. There we go. Nice. Thank you, guys. Okay. So that's good. That's good. So let's see what we can do to the Titan. No, I'm healing. I'm healing again. All right, now I'm no more healing. I'm activating healing now so we could don't take too much damage. But look at the damage this guy's taking. That is a titan, dude. And we're basically killing that whole thing in a couple of shots. And that was really unlucky because we finally took damage and we were already destroyed. So the moment we started taking damage was the moment we, we, just, we got destroyed pretty much, right? So that is very unfortunate. But we still have three of those modules here on this Aochun. And I'm gonna be able to make use of that too. Okay, this guy is done. This guy's gonna use his shield. Come on, one more shot. That's it for you. Let's wait for it. Again, we have three of those modules here. So the moment we start taking some good damage here, we should be able to um, to start dealing 70, 85% more. No, in this case, it's 80, 80% 80 more damage. Okay. So let's just cap that beacon to prevent the match from, you know, ending too soon, from losing. And don't, guys, I will read all the donations that you have given me. I'm going to read them loud for everybody to hear. Even if it means, Manny, you're, you're a jerk. I don't like, look, I don't like <laughs> listening to you. I don't like watching your content. I'll still read it and I'll still appreciate uh, the, the thing. Okay. Um, seems like we're going to land a little bit in danger. Between everyone. Okay. Alright. There goes this guy. No, he's not yet dead. He's almost dead. Okay, a little bit more damage, sirs. Thank you, guys. Okay, so now we're dealing 50% more damage, okay? And no, 80% more altogether. So, let's see the difference. Let's try and see the difference. I need to take a little bit more damage because I, I will heal with my ability. I will heal uh, once I start. Here we go. Come on, give me a few shots. There you go. Thank you. That's enough. And now look at the damage. Unfortunately, we're going to have to reload now. But even the built-in flamethrower do more damage. And uh, these double boomers that we have on this thing are just insane. That's like, that's almost like four redeemers firing, I think. Or is it three? What do you guys say in the stream chat? I read that they do stack up. But look, it doesn't actually look like we're doing 80% more damage. To that doesn't look like 80% more damage to me, if you ask me. Oh, wait. Yeah, we, we lost the, the threshold. We're, under we're, we're belie beneath the threshold. That's why. We need to take more damage. There we go. Now. Now we have enough damage taken. Okay. Here we go. There we go. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Now that is more damage. Oh my god, look at the health that he drops. <laughs> he was dropping health so fast, and that despite being a titan up there. Unfortunately, the match is going to be over, but you can already see where this live stream of two hours is going to go with that much damage output. And man, am I going to be happy when we drop the behemoth at the right point, at the right time, we get the right amount of damage so we can have 80%, 85% more damage output with a behemoth. We can take down titans like a titan. Just 
not being a titan. All right, 4 million damage. Oh my lord, we haven't even run our titan, dude. <laughs> that is insane. All right, so tons of donations uh, and that I have that I have to read um, and I will. Um, and uh, thank you guys, by the way, for tuning in. 2,200 people. If you like the content, you want to see more such stuff where we test modules or whatnot, then subscribe to the channel. If you haven't done that yet, guys, we're locking into the next match and I'm going to have a look at the donation messages. Eight minutes ago, seven minutes ago, five, two, one. What the heck? You guys are amazing. <laughs> we have Lion837. Hi, Manny. Could you get a godlike? Did we just have a godlike? If not, we're going to have one. Don't you worry about it, sir. <laughs> Uh, let's start with the Cerberus here. Uh, then we have uh, Country Boy with a dollar. Thank you, sir. Travis Keate with a two dollar. Please use Hussar Magnum Ares with a lockdown ammo. Sometime else, okay? Some other time. Now I've already made the hangar, dude. Um, Dominic M with a ten dollars. He says, Manny, just remember to edit out the bad words. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's right. Thanks for the hint, man. However, during life, that might become a bit difficult to pull off. Okay, here we have this guy locked, and look at that! Oh, I was just gonna say, look at that sweet damage. But he's like, nope, I'm not gonna take that damage from you. But you know what? Um, as soon as he reappears, we should be able to uh, get him. Boop! There we go. Got you locked again. And he is face shifting again. Ultra max and top end meta player here, with double face shift. And, um, yeah. And boop! Lockdown and suppression again. There we go. Thankfully, we had some support. Let's get keep going with the donations. Um, Dominic, another tenor. He says, you're an amazing streamer. Have an amazing day. Wait, that's not Dominic M, though. That's a different Dominic. Thank you, sir. I really appreciate it. And it's awesome that we have multiple Dominics roaming around now. Um, let's get this guy locked before he jump. Wait, he's not locked, actually. He was suppressed, but he did not get locked. All right, let's get him. Let, let him run into all those sweet flamers. Yep, and that's it for you, bud. And boop. Oh, I messed this one up, I guess. All right. We're going to lose this battle, of course, because, uh, you know, he can constantly shield himself. Pew! Oh, I didn't get him locked. He got me down to last stand, which is not a problem. We're just going to camp the beacon here for as long as it takes for this guy to finally be done with us here. Okay, he's suppressed and locked. And there I am dead, but I'm pretty sure he's gonna die too. Um, there it is. Oh, I thought I killed him, by the way. I have to keep reading. Um, we have um, Christian Madriada, boom, with a 20. <laughs> As usual, Christian, you are amazing, sir. Thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate it, sir. All right, we have someone coming up here, and he is now starting to leech, which is really bad timing for a leech ability, by the way. Okay, so let's drop this guy here. Now we're below the damage threshold, so from this point on, we're gonna take a uh, deal more damage. We're gonna take the beacon back if possible. Okay, we're I guess we're not gonna have it much longer because we have an Arthur on it. But maybe, since the Arthur seem to be busy, nope. He's not actually busy doing other things. But I have him turned around there. I can waste his time forever while he gets killed in the meantime. I'm just gonna waste your time, buddy. Yep, and bye-bye. <laughs> That's what this robot can do better than any other. Wasting people's time. It's the time waster. That's how this thing could, should be called. Not Ravana, it should be called the time waster. Oh man, more donations are popping in at right now. Stop shooting this guy, he's leeching me, by the way. I don't like when you guys are killing me. So now he's no more leeching. I'm done. Okay. Okay, there you go. All right. Let's just do some damage to that guy up here with his Titan. Nice. Then we land back in safety, or what I think is safety. Yes, it worked. Um, War Robots 101, $2. Hey, Manny, what is your favorite Titan? Uh, definitely the Ao Ming currently. 
Not because it's necessarily the best one. I think the Nodens has a better, bigger impact on the battlefield. But what I like about uh, the, um, the, the Ao Ming is that, you know, it has the angle. The perfect firing angle on the enemy. Okay. I'm gonna lose my... Oh, you're already... Okay. That's interesting that he had the leech ability that... Er oh, it's a, it's a top and ultra meta player from before. I re realize, okay. It's the guy with the double face shift on every single robot and all that. Okay. Um, so, I'm gonna be ready for you here. Wow. That was an amazing move there that this guy gave me. Did you see the, the speed at which I just flew away? That was really cool, man. By the way, we're doing more damage right now. But we're not gonna do it for much longer because... Turns out we're in a... Quite a tricky spot here. Alright, you know what? It's enough. Enough with this. I'm, I'm sick of that. There we go. Let's do something here. That little thing is not going to shield you, sir. So let's get rid of this guy. And then... Getting rid of this guy afterwards. And then this. And I kept the lock on because I quick switched from one guy to the next immediately. Okay, I knew he was gonna fly. We, we are still losing in terms of beacon control. A problem is that we currently lost... Um, we haven't... We're not yet reloading. That's a problem. But I think we're running out of enemy robots soon. I have to reload and we're capturing more and more beacons. Alright. Now, that we are reloading anyways... This guy's leech ability is not gonna help. Because um, the these weapons with their level bypass the resistance. Let's have a look at the description, uh, the the viewers here and the donations. Hydra Br Broodmaster 36. Any new robots coming out? Not at this point. Uh, except yo the Scorpion, I guess. The Scorpion would be the new robot that would be coming out sometime soon. He locked me down, by the way. Not sure why. Uh, but I think he also got locked. Um, so the Scorpion would be the next robot, but I've sent some feedback into Pixonic asking them to pre- to reconsider uh, the, um, do you notice how he's coming for me? Look at that. Uh, I asked them to reconsider the ability, uh, the teleport ability. By the way, 80% of his shots went into nowhere. Wow, he lags so hard that I can't, that I can't damage him. Yep, that's uh, about it for him here. Crazy damage. Um, yeah, but so I've asked him to reconsider uh, the ability on um, uh, on the uh, the teleport ability on the scorpion because it really is a bit too crazy and it would ca ca cause a lot of chaos. Um, for those who don't know, uh, just check out one of my recent... Oh my god, I still have this. I can't believe I still have those crashes. Um, check out one of my recent videos where we tested uh, the Scorpion two times uh, with the gameplay videos. And uh, you'll see what I mean um, with the um, uh, with the thing. What is it called? Uh, with the teleport ability. You can basically no more run Vortex or Thermite setups because they would be free kills. We have a... Um any new robot? Uh, then we have Rad with a five dollar super chat. My five year old son uh, Keshav is a big fan and still says hi. Uh, and he says hi. Oh hey, hi Kesh Keshav. I, I hope I say the name right. Keshav, greetings. <laughs> and uh, thanks Rad too um, from your dad. And Dominique again with a with a ten dollar. Yes, I'm a different Dominique. Here have another ten. Oh wait a minute, it's not the same. It, huh? It. Yes, I'm a different Dominique. Have another tenor, he says. Hey, thank you, sir. So much appreciated, man. Let's jump into another battle and let's let's try free for all once, okay? Let's try free for all. Ryder, what message do you mean? I thought I've caught them all. All right. Um. After the stream, YouTube doesn't allow me to. Um. Uh. Okay. Um, Tejas, Tejas was uh, apparently someone was false, was by accident banned in the stream. I don't know who or wha how it happened. 
Teas, Teas seem to have been accidentally banned or so. Uh, we're we're gonna take. In case you're still watching, we're gonna take care of it. Um, uh, in case you, uh, you know, we're, we're gonna take care of it later. Look how there's only our chuns flying everywhere. Look that. Look at that. Isn't that insane? The world is infested with our chuns. All right, so. Let's try and kill steal that. There we go. He's probably gonna fly soon. Yep, there it is. We knew that was gonna happen. Let's let him drop us down below the health pool that we have here with the thing. And then with the 50% more damage output, we should be able to take care of him rather well. There we go. Nice. All right. So, taking care of these two guys, but we are still only uh, second, uh, which is not a problem. Let's just uh, run around a little and have some fun. This guy is dealing some sweet damage to him. Okay, down to his last stand. And boom, getting the kill afterwards. Again, we're doing 50% more damage. But it might not be enough. Well, let's see. Maybe we just run past him and make him lose the lock-on. It didn't work, though. He still saw us. I think this is the guy from before. Okay, I ran around the corner away from one guy. Wait, there is still someone behind me? How? Oh, he walked down here. Okay, I took this one. Oh, uh, and dang it. Okay, we didn't get that one. All right, so let's use the Aochun here for a second. Uh, check here after the battle. Okay. Yeah, uh, I hope I, I said it right and it's okay with the way I said it here, Ryder. So what's going on here? Someone is uh, getting kills. Enemy one is gathering kills, quite a few. Okay, I'm trying to uh, to get him, but he doesn't seem to be... Nope, he's not flying up anytime soon, it seems. I would have been able to kill him. Yep, and he's going straight for me here. I don't know what he was doing right there. Uh, it seems like he wasn't interested in actually fighting. Oh, what? How did I not get the- What? That is insane. That is insane. I didn't think that we were not gonna get this one. Uh-oh. Okay, he's now doing this. I can't get him here. I still can't get him! What the heck? He was not having the ability running. Did you see that? The ability was not running. And yet, somehow, the, the game uh, gave him invincibility. Maybe it was running, and we just didn't see it. We had that before, too. You may remember that we also had the ability before. Ah, uh, okay. So. Let's keep going. We have uh, our, our counter player here. He seems to be absolutely ha happy with just sending rockets around the corner here. Now we are dealing more damage to him. Okay. We're flying up. And then we have him due to the thing. And this guy, man. This guy. With his constant shooting into my flank. But he's gonna lose that ability soon. Oh no, come on. Oh what? He gets to he gets to whoop me like a baby, dude. He gets to whoop me completely, dude. I can't believe it. I can't believe he whooped me like that. Unbelievable. And now he's getting the next whoop uh, the whooping. He gets the next one a whooper. <laughs> a whooping. Unbelievable! He I, I would have two-shot killed him, but I couldn't. 
I couldn't two-shot kill him uh, because he would phase shift and then after the phase shift, he insta-killed me. I don't understand how they, do, how they don't lose their lock-on. I don't understand how they don't lose their lock-on when they fly straight above me. Okay, there we go. Now, see the Aochun is still an insane beast and with three of these damage modules, it gets even crazier. Okay, hold on. Well, where are we gonna? I, I'm still not using last end, but in this case, it might be useful for me because you know I haven't, re I have never been using last end anyways, so not really much changing for me here. Wow, he's like, okay, let's go for player number one. Good point. Okay, we're already having the damage booster rocking. Wow. I can't believe I don't get the kills with that damage alpha. With that alpha strike, there should be no doubt about who's gonna get that kill. He stays, he stays perfectly behind the corner. No chance for me to get that kill. Reloading one of the weapons. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Uh, that is really close. Oh, by the way, that reminds me, right? I have read a... Uh, um, I've read a message from someone uh, on YouTube who said that he enjoys my content and he's really thankful for all, you know, all the fun moments we had together. But he's gonna have to unsubscribe uh, because I use the... Um, I too often I say, oh my god, or I use the word of the Lord in vain, he said. Um, that's a good point. I never thought about that, right? I never considered that. It's like it comes out by, by uh, like almost automatically by, by at this point. Um, but it was it's something I never thought about, right? So it's one of those things that, you, 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 that you'll, you'll do without thinking about it. And... Yeah, so in this case, this guy was absolutely right, man. I said this uh, a lot. Okay, here goes this guy. And um, yeah, so did I just do that much damage to me with the leeching? Okay, interesting. Uh, but at the same time, you guys, uh, those who may have also don't like that, please don't forget that um, I'm no, not natively speaking English, right? And uh, I, my vocabulary is sadly lower than the ones of most of you guys um, so this is where I have to find you know different ways of expressing certain thoughts and things um, where you guys have a much more broad variety of uh, possibilities um, yeah all right, I got this kill. I knew I was gonna w lose the fight against uh, the leech. I couldn't fight them both, and it's very evident that they go both at me. Let's use the Titan for the last few seconds here, and have some fun with that. Phase shift one. Phase shift two. Phase shift three. Nope. He wanted to, but the other guy wouldn't get, get himself killed. Match is almost over. Alright. Um, we have Mixfand Gaming. Uh, what the heck? It's only money. <laughs> oh, he says, what the heck? Let's drop some. It's only money. Why? Look at these guys! They're dropping next to each other. What the heck is this? Why are they, Why are they spawning like this? You have to turn around, sir. You have to turn around. There is no way around this. Come on. There you go. My kill, dude. <laughs> no! <laughs> I stole it. Why did they drop next to each other? What the heck was that? Are they like a team or what is this? 
We also had um, Matt Morrison with a five dollar. Um, or no, five pounds in the, it is. Hey Manny, been watching you since 30k. <laughs> since since 30k, like Warhammer. Uh, no, uh, since I had 30k subscribers and then I stopped, but now I've come back. Makes me happy to see that your channel is doing well. Uh, keep up the great work. Thank you, Matt. That really appreciate it. It's really appreciated. And I'm happy to have you back, sir. Uh, how was your time in the meantime? Hope you get you had some fun time as well. Things were look w working well for me as well. So um, yeah, cool. Cool to have you reunited or us reunited. Reunited, that's it. Uh, ZH4Y. Hey, Manny, good job. Thanks, buddy. Um, from, from, from the Schweiz, oder? From, from Switzerland, I guess. Because it's Schweizer Franken that we're getting here. Um, so, greetings, buddy. Gr greetings, neighbor. <laughs> and uh, so, let's, uh, let's see if we can make sure that this beacon belongs to us. You are belong to us. That's right. Yeah, I already see this guy coming up. Let's use some phase shift here. Oh, this guy didn't see that I was phase shifting. You saw that, right? I'm waiting for it, and here we go. I was waiting for that specter shot. Now we're gonna take this guy out. And after this shot, he's gonna fire. Oh, he got me. Okay, we knew that was gonna happen. Now I'm low on health. That means I will now get the added bonus of firepower. Come on! I can't kill this guy! All right, let's get close here. This guy right here, he just can't be killed. He's like unlimited amounts of health, somehow. Alright, we dropped two, we hit him twice. And as I, again, we're doing 50% more with every shot that we take right here, but we only have one weapon left out of three. So, um, yeah. This could be a good moment for the behemoth. Let's drop in that, be that behemoth. Let's wait for him. Is he not coming? No, he's not. He was afraid. He saw all, how many people spawned here, and he's like, Oh, God, no, I'm not running in there. Okay, so... Nope, I can't hit this guy, but I can hit him. Now, he's bringing up that shield. All right. We have to take some damage, ladies and gentlemen. I want to get you more damage output here. So, he's leeching. That's good for us. Somebody, please do some damage to me. I need to take damage, guys. It lags so hard that even the auto-aiming weapons kind of miss. So he's coming at us with shotguns, I think, or flamethrowers or whatnot. Alright, there we go. Now we have taken enough damage, and boom. I'm, I'm counter-healing some of that damage. Is he currently le- he is absolutely- he was actually currently leeching. Can you imagine? Can you imagine this? I was in a two-on-one battle and he had nothing better to do but to stand there in the back and leech at me already. But in return I took him down. <laughs> so, we lost two but we've killed a lot of dudes. Let's get in with the Auchun. Uh, phase shift is better than advanced repair. Change my mind. Uh, Xara Anado, Anador. Uh, I'll change your mind. Don't worry. Um, there's a reason why I went with repair this time. Normally, I, I would choose phase shift too. But in this case, I want to be able to, uh, you know, stay alive for a very long time. Does he have phase shift? And uh, I want to I wanna hold a position for a long time. Healing will let me do this better, in my opinion, than... Look at the lags, man. This game is becoming unplayable, dude. It's like the guy is like standing in mid-open. Boop! He teleports behind the wall. And all my, my chances to get him killed are worthless or gone. Because uh, the game lags so hard. 
It's insane. Come on. Get me a little bit further down on health. That's that's good. A little bit more. That's good. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Now nah, a little bit more. One more shot, sir, please. One more shot. There we go. Thank you. Now, that gives me a, con a very good uh, amount of um, damage here. And there you go. So, the behemoth in the background there. He's ha he had quantum radar ticking, it seems. Something that I didn't see. Um, let's see. Maybe we're gonna see some uh, some reason why I think phase shift might might in some cases be less useful. Look at that damage. Yep, got hit here. Okay. Are we falling? <laughs> no! No! Damn it! That was not supposed to happen! I was I uh, I wasn't supposed to fall down like this. I thought I was gonna back off and land perfectly on the bridge. This death was brought to you by Manny! Alright, um Let's see what we can do here. Uh, we could use the Spec Ops Falcon, but I'm gonna make a separate video about this guy now with the updated um, Spec Opsy. <laughs> so this guy thinks his leech ability is gonna save him. But nope, sorry dude, it's not. And that Arthur? He's gonna he's gonna he's got a pretty good spot right there. I'm relatively safe here. And can shoot this um, this guy over in the distance. He's losing pretty much that entire Titan. Let's reload the main weapon here. The way how I'm going to kill that Titan. Alright. I have a way of killing uh, Arthur's uh, that I really enjoy. For this, I just have to get a bit closer. Alright. That Arthur is al already knows what's going to happen. Unfortunately, I'm slowed down right now. So here we go. That Arthur, not a problem when we are above him. Because his, sh his physical shield doesn't work when I'm right above him. I will just fly over him and it's not a, not a biggie. Alright. Let's see where he drops in. So far, no one has dropped anywhere. Oh, now they have. Here we go. I, I I noticed you. I saw you, dude. Don't worry. I was just waiting for you to spawn. I knew you were gonna do it, and there it is. And I thought he might bring a Titan. Alright, this guy. His leech ability is worthless again. I'm using him to reload my weapons here real quick. Another author. And I'm so high up that maybe even from up here, I will be able to uh, bypass his shield. Let's see when we start dealing damage from here. Now it is. Okay, here, see? Or we destroyed the shield. One of these two things. I'm not sure. Alright, so. <clears throat> Aha. Phase shift will not help you, for example, if you have taken a certain amount of damage. To get back up in health, right? For example, you're standing with a with a behemoth in a distance, and you want to snipe, um, and you you have an, a flying out chun coming at you. Uh, he's going to do damage to you. There's like very little, um, you know, what you what you can do about it. But uh, with the healing module, you can can get yourself back up afterwards. Well, well, the face shift will not help you with that. It'll just you know prevent you from taking damage. But uh, that that is not always the case with a with an out chun that flies stealthed for 10 seconds, you know? And this would be one example where I think as a sniper, the healing could sometimes be more useful than, um, than the other way around. Wow, we have four fast robots coming in hot for the beacon. I, I'm just gonna jump out of the, am I gonna jump out of the window if I say we're gonna get that beacon? Is that even a saying, jump out of the window? Am I gonna lean myself out too far out of the window? Is that's that's how you say it, is it? I'm not sure how you say it. My kill. I did it all by myself. That was only me. 
Without you, with, without me, you guys would have never been able to do this. <laughs> I came with a shotgun. Boop. One hit. Finish. All right. So. Boop. Now there goes his, his built-in weapons. And this other guy is currently leeching. He's dead. So let's take this guy. All right. A little bit more damage. And we're going to have the 50% more. There it is. Now we are dealing 50% more damage. And boom, boom, boom. Nice. I think he's pretty much done. With 50% more damage output against this guy here. He already... I think he already lost his physical shield. Boom. No chance. Look at that damage. Of course we sacrificed some health. Right? We sacrificed some health here by doing this, but, um... Not too much of a problem there. This guy's dropping his, his ability now. Okay, here we go. And boom. Boom. I could... That would be awesome if I could kill the guy behind me too. But I can't kill them both. <laughs> I can only get one of them. I was just, I just ran into the enemy base and I just destroyed the heck out of these guys. I just killed them in their own base over and over and over again with just one robot. That shows how ridiculous the, the Ravana invincibility thing is for how so long, right? Boom. My kill. See that guy? Okay, one, two, three, four. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Wow. Yep. And we have a six... No, wait. Allah! Hey, 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 sir. Sir, that's not cool. He wants away. Yep, he wants to get away from us here. <laughs> I need a little bit more damage, guys. Could you please do a bit more damage to me? Come on. You there, sniper. Sniper boy. You there. Give me damage. Yes, thank you. That is cool. Now, with this much damage output, three-shot killing, pretty much... What? Is there something else? Uh-oh, I have to get away from here. I have- now I have the 85% damage boost currently running, okay? So whatever I shoot now is going to take 85% more damage. Wow, I'm taking tremendous amounts of damage here. Let's go for the Titan. Yeah, this is not how I wanted this, but, uh, this is what I've got, unfortunately. Yep, there we go. This is it's just an old but behemoth. It's actually not that old, but it's so worthless. Uh, because any other robot would, would be better than this. Uh, you know, Fury is the same. Fury, behemoth, they're all terrible robots. Reason is because they don't have resistance, right? Other robots have ridiculous amount of resistance. They just stand there and they're undestructible when they stand there. They have their ability running. Heck, and you can do whatever the heck you want. You won't get that thing destroyed. You just won't. And that is not a thing with a behemoth. Because it might be slow and bulky and worthless and not be able to do much. Uh, but at the same time, it has no resistance and it gets it will get killed so easily. If you ask me, the behemoth should get resistance when he deploys. He is no more able to move. Move. He becomes a free kill for many f robots. And in return, he should get resistance. Like 30% resistance or... That would make the behemoth a really interesting thing. Okay. Here comes the specter. From before. Oh my god, of course you decide to now do this. <laughs> Out of all the moments. Uh. Okay. I'm face shifting. We have to take a little bit more damage to get the 50%. That is a bit too much damage if you ask me, guys. But I'll take it. Let's see what we can do against the Titan. 
with the 50 percent with this 85 percent more damage but we are of course getting attacked by a flying Aochun. Yep, I took down almost the entire Titan. You see this? I almost... Whoa, I got killed by the Blast Wave? What? How? There was an Arthur? Behind me? Underneath me? What was the Arthur? Somewhere was an Arthur that just gave me a Blast Wave. I want to get the... This guy, okay. Always quick switching to not lose the lock on. And it won't be long before we break through this Arthur physical shield right there. Ryan, I have noticed how you focused me throughout the entire match. Or not, maybe not the entire match, but uh, definitely the last two robots I was using. So there you go. And every time pressing the retargeting button uh, before... Um, before the thing. Alright, switching target. He's bringing up the physical shield that will not really hold for a very long time. Healing. Okay, what do we have here? I don't know. That, by the way, was a typical Yamantel match. One team gets the beacon in the middle of the game, and that's it. Boom. Match is over. Beacon got captured. So this is, uh, this is the problem, in my opinion, with Yamantel. The guys who first get the beacon pretty much own it for the rest of the match. Uh, and that's, it, it rarely ends any other way, unless the other team is really much pow more powerful. Let's, let's drop uh, the new music here. Let's go with that. I cut I cut them together into a very long song and made them really surprising for you guys. Hopefully you like it. Let's start with a behemoth immediately. There we go. Uh, I think we have some phantoms or whatever. Usually we have phantoms coming to the left side, attacking the beacon. And in, the, in, in, in which, which case I would use... Yep, there it is. In which case, I use the opportunity to do some, some damage to him here. Oh, another phantom is coming. Two more phantoms are coming. Whoa! Okay, that would have been awesome if it had worked. <laughs> it would have been amazing if it had worked. Could you please keep doing this, sir? Could you keep... Yeah, yeah, that's good. Because I need to lose a little bit more health. More. More. Now, that's good. Now we can finally... Did you see how fast we go through his physical shield? <laughs> oh my god! And there it was again. The oh god, laggy, laggy, ultra lag. What the heck? Okay, now we're gonna suffer some sweet damage here. Especially since we first have to get away. But the good thing is, we can no longer get above our health point with a. Um, Triple kill. You see in the upper left, our maximum health is now below the mark where we get increased damage output. Are they gonna get that beacon? Because that would really be bad. They have a very tanky Inquisitor. I'm gonna try and help the Inquisitor there with my damage boost. I think I got him two times or three times, I don't know. How often exactly I got him. Um, but good job, Harris. Defending, or Harry. Defending that beacon. Really good job. By the way, if you ask me, I think uh, the um, uh, the Loki should not be able to capture beacons uh, while he's in stealth. <laughs> stealth denied. Yes. Um, I think the Loki should not be able to capture beacons from stealth. It just makes no sense that the guy can just run around indefinitely and just basically kill your match. Come on, drop that shield. Drop it. Drop that shield. That's right. Boom. One shot and he's down to last stand, man. 
Boom, boom. Boom. Okay. What? How often is he doing this? Wow, before he could activate the thing. Oh, he just dropped his, stel uh, his shield. Okay. Now we have to gather some, some ammo here. Because we have an enemy titan. And he's trying to walk in range. See that? We are out of his range right now. Let's just fire empty all we've got here. And then get in cover. Because I think we might be able to just shoot th over this rock here. He's locked. Yeah, only the two left weapons can. But that's good enough. Okay, now he's leeching. Uh-huh. Okay, we have him coming back out. How long it takes for these behemoth legs to turn around is just insane. Are we safe here? Ah, that's it for him. Now I've got him. Titan Slayer. Oh ho ho! Do you see this damage output? This is just brutal. Triple kill. Okay, this guy, he has 500 meters range. I'm going away from him now. Here we go. Look at that damage. Look at that. <laughs> He's locked slightly out of his reach. Bringing out the weapons again, and boom. Boom. Wow. Oh my lord. Let's take that Ares. Okay. The Natasha wanted to walk past us, but he couldn't. Yep. There he goes. Oh, he just jumped down. I can't hit him there, somehow. Come on, walk back up the ramp. No, he doesn't. He's pretty comfortable. Feels pretty comfortable right there, it seems. Aha! Our next victim. Here we go. And start. Boom! 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 <laughs> titan Slayer. That was a Titan. That was a Titan with 85% more damage output. Basically, we have seven Dragoons. Seven and a half Dragoons that we're shooting at the guy. Right? Almost. Almost seven and a half Dragoons that we have currently running on this setup here. Oh man, that was insane. So let's have a look at the donations. I think there is something new. Double kill. Uh, Leonardo Keller with two uh, Schweizer Frank. Oh, oh, victim, victim. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> you better land real quick, sir. You better land real quick. One more shot and that's it for you, man. Wowzers. I want to see how much damage we have done in this match, ladies and gentlemen. This is insane. It is complete freaking insanity. What do we have here? Ah, uh, okay. We have a setup that we can't really kill. Um, but what I can do is just shoot this guy, this Natasha over there. And then I'm dead. dead. Okay, let's get him in the air. Shot didn't count, it seems. Okay, and boop. <clears throat> so, ladies and gentlemen, what do you think about the um, about the module here? Uh, these three modules. In my opinion, this is really a cool thing to run on the Aochun because most people are running the last stand and they love their extra health. 
um, or their their extra uh, defense system, but I never ran last stand anyways because I always considered it too overpowered on an Aochun that is already, you know, every time you get another flight ability. Here, with this, I still have to fly careful. If I make a mistake with my flight, well, then I'm dead because I won't be able to get another flight before I'm dead. Um, so I have to be careful, but when I'm careful, when I play this right, then I can have so much fun with this extra damage output. So, jumping right into the next one. I love it. People say it's great. I love it. It's cool. Uh, God likes sunglasses. It's so cool. Yeah, I like, I like this. It's an alternative. It's finally a real alternative uh, to the, um, you know, to the last stand. Because let's be honest, there hasn't really been an alternative to last stand. Everyone was running last stand uh, because, you know, it's just five seconds or whatever, four and a half of invincibility while you can shoot the enemy. It's not like phase shift where you, uh, you know, you won't be able to fire yourself. No, you can fire and kill people while you're invincible. How insane is that, right? And uh, there has never been a, um, an alternative to it, but now there is. Wow, am I the only one running up here? It seems like it, huh? I could use a little bit extra damage here. Thank you, guys. Okay. Give me a little bit more damage, then I can take care of this guy. Yep, thank you, that is enough. Oh, you just dropped your resistance. Oh, that is a really bad timing, bro. Oh, there he goes. Resistance is over. Face shifting. Got this guy. Now, the enemy can spawn here, of course. And it will be very difficult for us to beat uh, to get this beacon. And this is what I meant, right? It's basically impossible to capture this base. We got it now, but look how many things we had to take down. Let's run inside his shield. Boom. And one hit kill him <laughs> with a 50% more damage. Jesus. Uh... By the way, does that count, too, as using the name of the Lord in vain by saying Jesus or Jeez? I don't know, ladies and gentlemen. I'm, uh, again, I'm, uh, I'm an amateur English speaker. I'm not, I'm not at the point where I can say I'm confidently, uh, confidently able to speak a perfect English. Everyone will still immediately notice that I'm not natively speaking English. Because the difference is just easy to recognize. Wow, we have a lot of people up here. 50% more damage output here. Boom. Uh-oh. Now, I don't want to lose my weapon immediately here. Boom, boom, boom. Wow, we pretty much one hit killed this guy. Is he down there? Yeah, he is. Okay. There was a, a, a... I mean, he's killed. In this case, it was a very surprising uh, event here. Normally, we would have lost this uh, this beacon here in the beginning and would have been very hard and a very long thing to get it back. In this case, we had just enough support to really go for it and... Uh, and just keep, you know, get it back pretty much, right? Whoops, uh, 50% more damage output incoming. He's almost killed after one salvo. Gee. <laughs> oh, man. So, you have good English, Jokey Ma Maki, Maki says. Thank you, sir. Uh, I have been improving it for a long time. Like, I have really been spending a lot of time trying to refine my English. Uh, but I'm still not happy. Like, there is... My vocabulary is still really low. That results in things like where, as people have pointed out, where very often I just... Um, I, I say things more repeatedly, more repetitive, right? More often. I want to have a more, better variety of, um, of ways to say things. But that I don't have. Give the music playlist. Oh man, this is not a playlist, man. This is just one song. It goes 15 minutes and I've cut it together. Tons of, tons of amazing songs that I've cut together into... One really amazing thing. 
Yeah, you're... Dude, you, you should know one thing, sir. You should know that your built-in weapons do not reach 600 meters. Just to let you know, buddy. Boom. Mine do, however. My weapons do reach that far. So, sorry. <laughs> What's the best way weapon for a T-Falcon? I like the Ember. I think Ember is amazing. It deals a lot of damage. Okay. Here we have this flying thing. No, I don't want to get into the range of the Arthur just yet. I think I'm going to stay out of that. It will take us a little while to get through this shield. However, it would be really useful to get some damage into our robot. Could you please shoot me two times or so? No, I see what's happening. The other guy's coming up. Yeah, he's closing in. You see the, um... The Ao Ming up there? Okay. Let's hammer in some, some, some damage here. And hopefully someone shoots us down. Yep, yep, you. Come on. Come on, give me some. Give me some of that sweet damage. That's right. More. 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 And here we go. Boom. 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 Thank you, sir. Much appreciated. Now I need to take again a little bit of damage. Some more. Some more. A little bit. A little bit. That's perfect. Now I can no longer lose my uh, damage boost. And that shield won't hold for a very long time against uh, this much damage. Imagine, this is like this is like two behemoths firing at you. Right? This is like two behemoths. Look, the shield is gone. There it goes. I'm not sure how much range he's got. Ah, he's got Avengers. Alright. Let's show him what damage looks like. Oh, and this guy is coming in closer too. Both shields are gone. And there goes the Titan. Even Titans can effectively be killed by this. Boom. 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 Titan Slayer. Imagine this would be almost like a behemoth firing eight or seven dragoons at you. Or like two behemoths focusing you down like crazy. I need to hide behind this thing here. But first I have to take care of this guy. Look how he's trying. How He's like, what in the world? How is he doing this much damage? He's like, wait a minute. That can't be. I'm a tank. How is that possible? He's like. Boom. 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 Okay. He's coming in. And I'm doing this. Now I'm standing here in safety. His weapons don't reach me. And I'm just taking him down like a boss. Look at him trying to escape. Look at that huge titan. Just like, what the heck is going on, man? He's killing me. I have to go away. I have to retreat from a freaking behemoth. I can't believe it. Yep. But that's because this is two behemoths. <laughs> Don't mistake it for one behemoth. It's two of them. With 85. That's 185% in altogether damage. You get the money. Oh, I'm fine. Thanks for asking, man. Um, George Lopez. Cool name, by the way. Um, I'm currently in the, in the midst of a... Uh, of some amazing damage run. Alright, so let's keep going with some more... We could try Team Deathmatch. If we're unlucky, then we get back into a match where there's like super powerful meta clans dominating in the enemy team. You know, you're that's something you can't really do something about. Uh, but let's see. Maybe we're not as unlucky and we get to have some more. Um... Which is which side? Uh, that's the side I want to get on. All right. So, we're dropping the behemoth immediately. And uh, this guy, he's like, hey, man, could, you, could I do you a favor? Uh, I, if you want to, I can bring you down to your thing where you do more damage. 
So I'm like, hey, thank you, sir. Yeah, I'll take that. Could you do a bit more, please? I need some more damage. That's not enough. Come on, guys. Yep, that's already pretty good, but I need some more because otherwise uh, I won't be able to... So here, now I'm in... Now I'm good. Okay, he... Unfortunately, he still found a way to go back. I thought he was already at the edge of the map. Alright, so this is already a pretty cool start. Okay. He got taken out right there. See, I'm healing. I'm still healing more damage, and that's the problem. Now. Okay, I have to get away from this point now, because a flying out Chun is nothing to be messed with. But I pretty much killed that nemesis. That nemesis right there, pretty much dead. I have to catch this guy. If he gets another flight, I'm done. I have to catch him. I've got no other choice. Okay, now this guy. And he immediately dropped his Ares, uh, Ares shield there. And now he rage quit it. Okay. Um. Oh, hello. Hi, sir. Oh, you thought this was gonna be easy, didn't you? <laughs> Sorry, that was two behemoths killing you. Uh, just to let you know, maybe we can bait him to shoot into the wall. Oh, it didn't quite work, but I have an idea. How about this? Yeah, isn't that awesome? Isn't that awesome? <laughs> Look at that guy. He was like, oh, I've got, I've, I've, I'm set up. I have my perfect spot. Oh, look at this guy. He doesn't know what's coming for him. He feels like he's safe there. But man, you're so not safe. <laughs> Two behemoths. Eight weapons of the behemoth just absolutely flattening you. The problem is they can spawn there to the left, right? I cannot go too close to this point. Otherwise, they're gonna... How many things did we destroy, by the way, right? We don't have Last Stand, and we're running a behemoth. An immobile tank fortress. Uh, no, not, not, not even much of a fortress. It can take a little bit of a beating, but it's really actually relatively quickly killed. Um, and, you know, all it has really that is it has firepower. That's all it has at this point. It has firepower. Ah. I was hoping he would drop there, in front of us. Alright, maybe we can find a nice position here where he doesn't expect it. What the? Okay. Boom. 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 Three shots and kill. Now he's walking out. Okay, one, two. Wow! Okay, that's bad. That is bad for us. Because although we can do some damage to him, he's got 80% damage resistance on that thing. And I don't want to mess with that. I'm healing now. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. 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 <laughs> what the heck, dude? Alright, come out of your thing. Boom. Boom. Ah, okay. I don't, I don't know how many kills we have just brought our team. But man, was that insane. Was that insane. This much damage output. Is just... This is really the best for sniping now. The, these three, when, when you have these three modules, your behemoth sniper is going to get absolutely insane mode. Why are you not stealthing or facing? Come on, do something, dude. Boyle. Come on, Boyle. I know you have your stealth. Ah, uh, there it is. Not stealth, more like... Okay, there's the second one. Do you have the legendary pilot too? I don't know. Okay, now comes the regular phase shift, okay. After the regular phase shift, another one of those, okay, and... And then... Well, it's almost dying time. I'm reloading, unfortunately. My, 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 my buddy's gonna take care of it. I let you hope. I let my homeboy finish you off. That's right. Thanks, homeboy. <laughs> Reminds me of 8 Mile, man. I still know all that stuff out of quite hard. Wait, he's not shooting me? 
I would have totally expected him to shoot. Oh, you know why he wasn't shooting me? Because he knew I would simply uh, stealth. I would simply stealth, stealth out of his way. That's why he didn't do it. Are you reloading now or what's going on? That's that timing for a reload sucked. All right, are you gonna respawn here? You know I have my ability ready, right? I uh, I didn't use it so far. I walked all the way up here without the ability to use. Man, this guy's just it's just been taking some damage. Let's sneak in from the side. Ah, he's walking back in. 600 meters range on that Titan. You know what? I'm just gonna camp their spawn because if I walk out here, I'm gonna take a lot of damage from the Titan. Although, a little bit of damage would be cool. Come on, give me a bit, a little bit, a bit more. I need some more. Yeah, that is okay. For the moment, that is okay. He's probably thinking like, what is this guy doing? Why is he allowing me to do free damage to him? What is going on here? That is a very unusual thing to happen. I could get a little bit more, please. So that the max damage goes beyond the line. Hey! Shoot me for guts! He's not even attacking! Would you please shoot me? Yes, okay, now he's done. Okay, good. Now we have the exact right amount of health. I wish I could start the battle like this. Seriously, guys, I would start... I would literally start... If I could choose, I would start the battle like this. I would start with losing... With not having much health. So here, with 50% additional damage output... We're just hammering down to this Titan. I don't know, I didn't have my Redeemer up, uh, reloaded, it seems. But man, is this guy going down. One of my Redeemers was not reloaded, really? Reload, people are saying in the stream chat. Yeah, you guys, you guys are right. I totally did not catch the fact that one of my Redeemers hasn't, hadn't been reloaded. So, let's go and have some fun with, uh, with this guy. Uh, you're gonna die just from the blast wave. I'm just saying. He's gonna die in a second. Two, one. No? Why is he not blast waving? Why is he not doing the blast? Oh, there it is. Okay. Did you see how quickly we killed this Titan? Freaking insane. Whoa, Dominique again with a twi- Whoa, 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 we had- we had some donations that I didn't pick up before. We have... We have many donations that I didn't pick up. Wow, hold on, okay. We have Leonardo Keller. Oh, I've already said that. Will there be pilots on- uh, on Titans? Will there be- Will there come pilots on Titans? Gesundheit okay? <laughs> yeah, Gesundheit super, danke. Um, uh, he- I'm- I'm- I'm healthy, I'm all good, thanks. Uh, and the other question was, will there be pilots for Titans? You're asking me as if as if I'm supposed to know this. I don't know. I uh, let's say at this point, why not, right? I mean, so far, why would they not bring pilots for Titans at this point? I wouldn't know why they wouldn't because it's almost made for it to be like that. So I guess yeah, probably, uh, but I can't say for sure. I mean, I could be wrong, but I, if you ask me, will there be pilots on Titans? I guess I think there might be. Um, and uh, if you ask me if I find this good or not, well, in right now, the Titans are already way too powerful, so right now, I don't think that would be a good idea. Uh, unless they nerf the Titans uh, drastically, so they don't completely overwhelm the entire battlefield like they do right now. Uh, especially, level, especially leveled Titans. We're speaking about Aumings, Nodens, leveled. And then also maybe team play, right? They can basically take out entire teams like like there were nothing. And and this is kind of the problem. Yep, a little bit more damage, please. A little bit more. I need to get into my 50% uh, mark. No, 60, 70%. And then we're still having a ton of B... Uh, someone is doing damage to me, that's good. Probably the leech, the leech ability down there. Okay, now we are in the right point. We have the right amount of damage output uh, taken now so that we can... No, we don't. We're actually above the point. 
And the reason we got above that is because I have this, um, this passive skill, this pilot skill, where when I activate the flight ability, I will start to heal. That's the problem. The problem is that we heal when we activate the, the flight ability. What the heck? He bounced me back up. Oh yeah, that's awesome. Thanks, man. He brought me beneath that. Okay, where are you? Oh, I can't see, dude! It's insane, I can't see! Uh-oh. That's not good. Let's face shift. And then, when he comes out of this, boom, boom, boom. Just completely hammer him away. We have the damage threshold for the increased damage output. 85% more. No, in this case, it's 80% because I don't have the Adrian pilot on this one. Wow, I love how the other Ao Chun immediately is like, okay, let's just go for Manny right there. Or, or you know, I'm not sure if he's like thinking about Manny, but definitely like, uh, let's go for this Ao Chun. And I was reloading. Interesting battle. We have, uh, we are being pushed quite a bit. Um, oh man, there's so many donations. You guys are so awesome today. You so incredibly helpful and uh, and contributing so much to the stream ladies and gentlemen much appreciated guys oh no okay now last stand is gone it's gonna come out of last stand there you go now how many other are down there it's this okay i see what they're trying to do or let's not say trying because they actually succeeded in that I could use some more damage output, guys. Come on. Thank you. That's perfect. Now I'm doing 50% more. Perfect dash. The perfect dash that he just did. It was exactly that time. Wow. I am a bit of in trouble here. And we cannot capture this beacon. For as long as these tanks are roaming around here, we cannot ta capture this beacon. And there's two more now. But in the meantime, I think we're, we're capturing their beacon, so... Yeah. He somehow was hovering in midair. You know what? What could I do here? We have captured their beacon somewhere else. They would just not die. They would respawn and respawn and respawn constantly and never die. I'm gonna kill him because he's got only so little health that it would almost be, uh, you know, a bad idea not to take him down here. But from here I can do so much damage to these guys. There goes this guy. This guy just exited the match. He's gonna respawn here. There it is. Boop. Lockdown. Nope. No lockdown possible. Because he had anti-control. Oh man, this feels like crashing again here. I know you want to go to the left side. You want to save your robot. Is he gonna respawn here? Nope. I don't think he has any more respawning robots. So, good time. Um, uh, Auchon didn't deserve the QR pilot, uh, the quantum radar pilot. Uh, Behemoth should have it instead, so you can run quantum radar and phase shift on the Behemoth. Um, and uh, it's time to give Behemoth some love. I agree. I agree with the Behemoth. Uh, who, ca who said that? That was War, uh, War Daddy War Robots. Thanks for the five dollars, by the way. Um, I agree. I agree that the Behemoth needs some love. However, I don't think the Behemoth should get. Um, built in quantum radar right that would make him probably too strong on the battlefield when it comes to tanks and when it comes to sniping it's already such a powerful sniper and it would get even more powerful and even crazier uh with um uh with this i think having giving him resistance in stationary mode would be the right thing to do 
It makes sense, right? It basically bores itself, itself into the ground, making itself more sturdy in the process. And, um, and, as, and as that, it should be able to also uh, take more damage in the meantime, you know? That's what I would like to see. Simply, uh, like, 30% damage resistance uh, when the behemoth is, uh, is deployed, when it's stationary. It can't move anymore, so giving it something would definitely go a long way of uh, helping it out. To uh, Because in, in the current meta, with all those robots that we have these days, it's not really possible to snipe or, or to use the behemoth in short range. The behemoth is like a 100% sniper. If you want to use it in short range, you get completely flattened by leeches, Ares, phantoms, anything. Everything will kill you. You don't stand a chance against any of those things in short range. Uh, it's like, and that's why it's like no, nothing but a sniper. It can't be anything else but a sniper. And um, yeah, resistant would, would help it to survive encounters in short range too and have a chance. So let's get away from this. Ah, he hit me. That's what I was trying to prevent. I got him locked and suppressed. Um, but uh, yeah, giving. Uh, I think I agree also, by the way, that the um, the Aochun shouldn't have gotten the Quantum Radar Pilot. I find it so r ridiculous. On one side, War uh, Pixonic nerfs the Aochun because it's too powerful, apparently. On the other side, they're giving it Quantum Radar built in. Like, what the heck? Make up your mind, please. It's too powerful. We all we all know it was, and uh, making that nerf, in my opinion, was okay. But giving it quantum radar at the same time makes no sense. It was just the wrong move. It should have been given to the Aokin, the small one that doesn't have any specials. Um, yeah. Then we have a Farbot E G. Is that example given or what's that E G? Farbot or Farbot? Thank you, sir. And we have Lord Britannia with thirty dollars. What? Boom! $30 out of nowhere from Lord Britannia here. Also a name that I re re recognize from the older streams. Thank you so much, Lord Britannia. I'm really enjoying the stream so far with my snacks. Keep up the good work, Manny, and keep calm. Lord. Oh, man. I'll try my very hardest. <laughs> oh, man. That mistake will follow me through the end of the earth, right? For those who don't know, I've made a video and I had... I, I, I had to re-record this video five times over over and over and had to restart stop the video and restart it why because people people kept exiting the battle too soon and the work made my video worthless basically and at some point i got so annoyed that i really started cursing some really bad words and then i forgot to cut it out normally i have this a family friendly show here and i'm not showing or you know making any such uh such comments but in this case uh yeah i uh I, I totally forgot to cut this out, and that, um, yeah, that was a really bad one. That was a really, really bad mistake right there. Um, and that's what he is referring to right now. He's probably like, why is he, how is he doing so much damage to me so quick, Rubatka? Uh-oh, we need to drop off! God sakes! I couldn't drop in soon enough. How, what did he use? What did he use to get there? A phantom. A phantom ran all the way over here, okay. Let's just drop him real quick. And while we're at it, I guess we could also say hi to this guy here. Okay. This guy doesn't know I'm behind him. And I'm capturing the beacon in the meantime. Brought him down to last stand. So easy peasy lemon squeezy took back the beacon. Yep, he's going down. Don't think he's gonna make it into another stealth ability. Nice job there. Ki... Kio Kanis Lupus. My lord, the names are so hard to pronounce sometimes. But yeah, um, what was I talking about? Yeah, that was a, a really bad mistake on my part. And I wish it never happened. And I'm pretty sure people will, uh, you know, will make me aware of this more and more and more times, more often. <laughs> okay, what do we have here? Okay. Face shifting. Ah, okay, he's got the flight ability ready. 
I'll be getting back to the donations in a second. I guess he's currently trying to capture this beacon. Not going to happen, buddy. Sorry. You may, you're, you're doing a good job for your team. We have to say here that... Um, who was it? Who, um, where is his name? Hubak, uh, Hubaka. He's doing a great job there for his team, man. He's capturing beacons so well. Uh, and ca ca catching us off guard with his with his amazing maneuvers of capturing beacons everywhere. We have to really give him some props for this, man. He's doing an awesome job. Into that shield? Nope, I'm not inside the shield, unfortunately. Okay, they got me down to last stand. That was already a pretty good success. Okay, I'm face shifting. Then I'm doing this. Wow, <laughs> that was a lot of firepower coming in on me. Lock down this guy over there. Is it an owl? Uh, is it a? Uh, I think that was a nightingale, wasn't it? Yeah, so, um, Lord Britannia again, thank you so much. And then we have Zeus the Mighty Oak. Uh-oh, I, ah, I couldn't get him locked. I wanted to get him locked so I can hit him really bad. Okay, let's wait. Oh, no, let, there's a different target that I'm going for. He's locked and suppressed. And apparently we're not the only one shooting down this guy. Uh, there is a Titan or some of some kind. Pew! Again, lockdown and suppression. Isn't it? Uh, it just super annoying to have uh, to have a, 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 a Cerberus against you when you're rocking a Titan. The last thing you want to have is a, is a Cerberus coming your way. I've got him locked and suppressed. He is currently capping the beacon, or he's trying to. I'm turning him around so that one of my team can hit him. Like you can't be safe from anyone. Anyone. You're either safe from them, or from me. You're not safe from anyone. See that? I just turn him around and my team is going to be able to shoot him into his flank. While I, for example, don't even need uh, his, uh, his, him to, sh to look the other way. This is something that he, that he apparently forgot. My flamethrowers don't care about his physical shields. He should have better looked at someone else because I will, I'm going to deal damage to him no matter what with the flamethrowers, right? And then we have Zoot the Almighty Oak, or the Mighty Oak. Uh, let's see what he said after the Titan goes down. Titan All right. Uh, he said, cheap advice in life. Never bow to people who, ha who are happy to explain to you how you should communicate. If you allow them to censor, oh my god, trust me, they'll, they'll be much more to come. Uh, you do just fine, change, uh, don't change who you are. Thank you so much, Zeus uh, the Mighty. I, th I guess you're probably right, um, but at the same time, uh, it gave me something to think about, you know? Um, I'm not saying that, oh god, I have been doing it wrong, okay? Not necessarily, but I did realize that my, my vocabulary still need some beefing up, right? My vocabulary we still could use a little bit of an upgrade, uh, especially when it comes to um, to saying things like, oh my god, constantly, you know? Like, holy cow, for example, would be an, you know, this is for an example that I could be saying more often instead of constantly saying, oh my god, you know? Um, so while you're cor correct, don't let people censor you all day long and, you know, uh, all this uh, political correctness stuff. I'm not a fan of this. I personally don't care too much about this. I, I often say what's on my mind. I say I say a black person instead of whatever because I don't think it's an insult. Black people say white people, white people say black people, and they, you know, it's why would anybody be insulted by this? I don't see how and why. Uh, so uh, not letting yourself get censored all day long around uh, and being like pushed. You cannot say this and you cannot say that. I understand, I'm with you here, but at the same time, I do see a need to upgrade my vocabulary still a little bit. So, um, yeah, but th thanks, man. Uh, also for the 20 bucks, sir, that is so awesome, man. <laughs> You're so generous, thank you so much. And then we have Don C with, uh, what is Ron? R-O-N, that's a currency, Ron. 
25 Ron he gave me. Um, and he didn't say anything. He's just like, here, have 25 Ron. <laughs> I don't know what it is, man. Thank you so much. And we have Dominic with a $10. Okay, I'm broke now. Enjoy the rest of your day, Manny. Thank you, Dominic. Uh, I uh, I feel bad for you being broke now. <laughs> um, but um, you have to have some money left for the drone thing, you remember? Don't forget that. <laughs> but obviously, you're going to get it back, right? You know what I'm talking about. Uh, so let's help out this guy against the Strider. The Strider boy. There's an Ares. Oh, wow. They realize they have to come for the beacon. Otherwise, they're going to lose it. Uh, he's doing a great job at staying behind cover. I can't kill him any longer. Now I can, and he didn't see that one coming. I'm helping my, my friend over there. I'm trying to help him, but it seems they might still be getting that beacon for the moment. Although, wait a minute, maybe not. You know what? I don't think they're going to get the beacon because this guy has done such an amazing job here that I can just take them all down now. Who was it? Who was the guy who just did that? Ty something, I think, was the name. Oh, I have to reload. Boom. 50% more damage, son. And now... Killing time. Boom. Wow, godlike, godlike, godlike. Wait. Oh, there's someone. Someone is down there. Oh man, the damage, the damage they suffer when I hit them with those double redeemers. Uh-ohs. I have to get down here. And we have a leech coming. He needs to be leeching at someone. Wow, my team is really good, doing a great job. Although, we did still lose the beacon. He's gonna bring up that physical shield of his. That, that means I'm flying above him. Uh-oh. Uh, <laughs> boom, boom, boom. 50% more, 50% more, and the guy's almost done. And the, the crazy thing is they can just go and uh, I can just hang hang around here and just kill them one by one because this other guy is just keeping them constantly busy. We're totally raiding their spawn. We're totally spawn raiding them here. Okay, can I kill him with the flamethrowers? No, but with the redeemer I can. <laughs> This guy is also like, wow, I've got some pretty cool backup here. <laughs> Unfortunately, we are still losing a lot of beacons on the map. We should probably try and go for some other beacons. But the problem is the moment we set foot away from here, there's a good chance we might lose the beacon there, you know? And I think that's the same thing that this guy just realized. By the way, we're no longer having 50% more damage output. He's still alive, though. That's interesting. There's more donations popping in. Let's get him to leech us. There it is. Leeching is going. Okay. Oh, wow. He's quantum radaring me. That hurts. Okay. He couldn't get that beacon, which is awesome. I stopped him from getting it. Although it seems like we do have a Titan on the battlefield anyways. Wow. This guy's down to last stand immediately. He's gonna get me now. Yep. Try to squeeze around the corner. But now we have turned this around. We have more beacons than they do now. Interesting. Okay. It's actually pretty cool this way because now the match will take a long time and we can deploy the behemoth here and have some fun. Okay, that, that guy is going to land now. Let's get ready for it. And boom. Boom. Wow. I guess that's a, a dead Auchun. Let's start that song from the beginning. I just want to hear it again. 
That's right. I want to hear, so listen to some more of it. Can't get enough. Bam, 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 bam. You need to get away from me a little bit. There we go. Okay, we're just tanking it. At this point, we're just tanking it. Unfortunately, though, I have to realize that with the Aochun coming in the back, they do have a little bit more than I want them to. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him and me. We're like, ah, you can't get to us. And when he lands, I'm hoping... Nope, nope, no chance. But someone is having it. So, uh, Dominique, I had that. Oh my god, I have to scroll up. There are so many people who, who contributed to the stream again. Wow. What is happening with you guys today? This is insane. This is insane. We have consumable GT. Um, uh, and that was 22 minutes ago. Look how far uh, how far behind I am. 22 minutes ago. I'm, I'm sorry, money, but I gotta go enjoying this. Uh, consumable GT, thank you, sir. Uh, and then we have... Uh, Kreisoft Vizek um, with uh, 20 Czechian Ch Czech? Is that the Czech currency? Uh, where are the godlike sunglasses, Manny? He's asking. I uh, They're somewhere outside, I think. I don't have them here. No, they're not here. Sorry. I would put them on. I don't think I have to deal with this over there. And the next, if somebody wants to spawn, the only way where they can spawn is there. Okay. Um, oh, the match is over anyways. Um, but uh, thanks, sir. And we have Dominique. Uh, wait, now I'm broke. He says an after another five dollars. Gee, what is happening here, Dominique? Don't do this. <laughs> Don't ruin your life for me. <laughs> that is awesome. Thank you so much. Hold on. Uh, I need some, some ventilation. Ugh. Getting, starting to get really warm here. Uh... <laughs> Down base or down bass. Where did I land here? Help. Oh, <laughs> oh, hi, Manny. <laughs> yeah, you're within the Manny live stream here. So, um, yeah, thanks for dropping by. Th thank you, sir. Uh, Evaristo, Rosedo, how I missed that video. Everyone made mistakes. I want I want to hear those bad words. Oh, believe me, you don't want to hear them, man. That was not entertaining. It was, it was pretty frightening, actually, I think, I've been told. So, um... Yeah, <laughs> uh, I'm glad you missed that video. Sorry. <laughs> and then we have Kiaran, no Kiaran Fox with twenty, uh, twenty dollars. Oh wow, twenty! Thank you so much. That's the, I think that's the first time I see you in this in the donation thing. Um, first time seeing your name, I think. Thank you so much. Um, and then we have, whoa, hold on. Uh, we are currently on the beacon, waiting for some damage drop. Oh wow, now I've taken a lot of damage suddenly. Much more than I wanted to. Uh, that was a hell burner. Okay, my last stand is ticking. Okay, we should be good. Wow. Where's that all my damage coming from? Okay, I'm dead, but uh, yeah, we got the beacon. So I guess it's kind of a success here. Wow, okay, I'm done. I'm done. I just lost my entire robot because it's it's this little thing. It's this little very weak um, Cerberus. You just kill this thing in like a minute or so uh, in like a sh in one shot Okay, let's get this guy All right now I'm in, in a bad spot here, but I want to take a little bit of damage anyways. Uh, I'm going to read uh, the ma message from uh, Kieran Frox in a second. Just going to have to deal with this here first. Okay, this guy just dropped his ability and he instantly phase shifts. Okay, I have to get him now. Now that his phase shift is running. Or not phase shift, his, his ability is gone. Okay, I am down to uh, low HP where I now have more damage output behind me too. Wow. Okay. Wow. Behind, behind. I turn around because I got attacked from behind and then I get attacked from behind, behind. Wow. 
That's bad. Okay, here we have him. He knows this is an easy kill. He knows this behemoth is a super easy kill for him. And he's absolutely happy with making great use of that. Why did I get healing only once? See what an easy kill this is? There's nothing heroic in that. They just just, just taken someone else who has no chance. And imagine now, you would have this coming up in the future with uh, with scorpions. You deploy a helpless a sniper. I just made the mistake of dropping in the middle, so that was my mistake. But imagine in the future, you drop a helpless sniper or you play a helpless sniper, and what happens is uh, they will they will just jump on you with these jump ability with these teleport abilities and they will just kill you with these scorpions right imagine this so someone is running through to capture our beacon over there with stealth with a quick low key okay and i'm going to attack their beacon in the meantime see if we can get that happening oh man i'm so far behind on the donations again he can't fly here that's his problem he wants to use his stealth ability but he can't fly here now he managed to do it okay and of course he gets to keep i just want to stress that real quick that he gets to keep both weapons right he was down to extremely low health but he gets to keep both weapons. This is a constant in uh, War of Wats for me. People keeping all their weapons while I would have lost one of my weapons already. I'm just gonna wait here. See if something will happen. Alright. You can stop running around. I'm not missing you because you're you're wiggling a little bit. You can you have to get up earlier if you want a, me to miss you because you're wiggling. You can stop it. I still don't know if I have the beacon. Do I have it? Yes, I do have it. Okay. I'm just gonna keep here, stay here. Uh, let's see if <laughs> if people will. Um, oh wait a minute. When they're dropping titans now, I you know what I think is happening. I think he's hitting me through the wall with uh, with the. Uh, with the Arthur Blast Wave ability. Eventually they get me killed with this, but um, I have some time still. And now I can spawn here with this, all right? Imagine what happens now. Look at this. I'm above him immediately. I knew that was gonna happen. I knew he wouldn't really have much of a chance there. And now this guy, okay. You have been firing into my flank for long enough, for free. They're all shooting me right now, and this guy, again, is taking all my time. Both of them are just, you know, they're just bouncing left and right and just wasting my time. I lost a heavy weapon already. I told you guys, this game is, is, it just does that with me all the time. I'm not losing a light weapon or something. I'm losing a heavy weapon. This leech robot right there just had a really bit of a problem there. Now I already lost two weapons. The Aochun before had less health than I have now. And uh, uh oh, I'm in trouble. Yep. And it's a well-leveled one on top. Um, and he dropped it so late. Uh, but he's he's, in, he's he's not gonna make it because he's low on ammo now. Although now there's two Titans against him. Yeah. They're, they might be able to make it, but they're not gonna win the battle. Because we have uh, beacon control. So he dropped his Titan a little bit too late. But yeah, so um, 
Fiang and Fox. Hey Manny, great stream. I'm going to go for a Cataclysm and Cyclones on my Aoming. Same as we have just done here. It is insane how much damage that can do. It's really brutal, man. Um, yeah, definitely not the wrong choice. If you have, if you don't have yet much, oh come on, enough with the Yamantau thing, please. Seen it two times already and played it. Let's choose something different. Um, yeah, so I, I, I definitely, um, can see why would you, you would go for them. They're, they're the best weapons in my opinion right now. So much damage they, they never have to reload, it's so crazy. Like, they, the reload, it takes so much firepower that you can do before you have to reload. Although I'm pretty sure they will eventually fix that. They're just not fixing it now, obviously. Should, should fix and address that immediately, how it's, how it me is meant to be. Um, then we have Don C again with 25 Ron, thanks, and Jeremy Davenport, Dornport. Thank you, Jeremy. Okay, I, I don't know what this is, uh, but it has a built-in uh, shield. Ares, Hades, Nemesis, whatever. One of those. Okay, how much damage do you want to do to me before you finally go away? Wow, I expected this guy to do- to go away much sooner. Oh, he's locked and he's still taking flame damage. Unfortunately, I couldn't catch him. And everything I want to shoot at immediately has an Ares shield, of course. Lockdown and suppression. And the next thing that will follow is death. Okay, another Ares shield. They're too slow now with the thing. Okay, down to last stand with him. And then finish. Whatever this is. Ares shield. Oh my lordy. Yep, this is becoming annoying. Thankfully, he set most of his firepower into my shield. Oh my, come on. I just started firing at him. I just sent my uh, my lockdown shot. Again, the, the same Ares who've done the thing ability already. Oh, I missed the next ability again. Because I keep running into this problem that uh, people are just having all kinds of abilities that protect them from me. He's gonna have another Ares shield really soon. There it is. But, um, we have him down to last stand, so he's not gonna make it much longer. Wow, wow, the damage I just suffered. Wow. From those couple of rockets from the Nemesis. Okay, lockdown ammo here. No, not locked. He's not locked. Ooh. I got him locked and suppressed, but it doesn't really help me much. I'm in the middle of the enemy team, it's so cool. I'm right here between all of them. And I'm still alive. Oh, he's leeching someone. And somehow he was not suppressed. His damage output was full. He's doing full damage output, not suppressed. Even though he was locked. Hmm. Okay, is he going to capture this? No, 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 no. Oh. I already noticed. I already noticed he wasn't going to get it because he walked out of the cap, cap circle. Alright, dealing some quite damage here. Alright. Now he's going to fly back and land. And he was kind enough to get me above the 50% or uh, the additional 75% I'm getting now. That's cool. Let's see how much damage that will do. Oh uh, no, we lost it again. We lost the additional damage output.
Okay, well, I think we have a good spot here to shoot this Titan from. Wait, is this a different, a new one? This is a new one, right? It's not the same one from before. So again, we have more than 50% damage output here. Thanks for the target switch. I love that. I love when I'm when I'm switching target to someone. While I'm shooting him and the game is like, oh, oh, you don't want to kill him anymore, right? He's right in front of you and you could kill him now. How about a target switch and you aim at this one now? <laughs> I knew that he was going to try and shoot me. Every time he's going to fire. He didn't get me with this. I'm now behind him. So I can do some good damage here. Oh, he's dropping onto the beacon. Uh, I was hoping it brings me down to doing more damage, but... He didn't do enough damage with this. Ah, I knew it! I knew you were gonna do that! Yeah, it's not the best idea to turn around now after you have a Nao Ming flying above your head. Okay. You're not gonna win this because I, I was full on these weapons. Look, we're doing the same thing. He does the same thing that I'm doing to him. And he didn't even get me down to the damage mark. Ugh. I, I didn't even do my 50% more damage. Now. Okay, he did it. Now I'm can, I can do some more damage. That's good. I'm suppressed, although. Have to wait for the suppression to wear out. And now, 50% more. Boom, 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 boom. Wow. This is just insane. Uh, wait. Oh, that's an, uh, that's an enemy right there. Let's go for him because he's taking more damage. And now the match is over. Dang it! Um, what's your best titan? Hmm... I, you know, I guess this Al Ming with the lasers would be the best titan. <laughs> the writer says the the bad words were entertaining except for the parents they were not amused or not entertained <laughs> well in any case it was not supposed to happen and uh yeah made a bit of a mistake here money salam salam youtube says hey hey sir so uh what the arthur is a good titan yeah but i think the uh the nodens would be if you want to have the strongest impact on the battlefield like, you want to do, um, change the battlefield in favor of your team the most. The Nodens is the way to go. Oh, yeah, he's got, uh, he's got the blue, um, thing that I also have. But we have used it on him. Next time I'm hitting you, there's no more escaping this. See, now he's locked and suppressed. All right, but I unfortunately had two enemies above, against me. Got him locked and suppressed again before he managed to uh, uh, to fly. Okay, get him here. Suppression and locked. He's not going anywhere. Nice. He's gonna leech, and they're all going to leech now. There it is. I made all of them use their leech abilities, which is just perfect. And oh, lockdown and suppression, and guess what? Your leech ability is over. Boop. Boom, lockdown, lockdown and suppression. You know, people say that the Cerberus is incredibly weak and bad. I think the Cerberus is a very powerful robot. It just has to be played the right way. And if you do that, you're going to be able to do a lot with it. 
Now, unfortunately, I'm reloading. If I wasn't, I could kill him here. Locked down and suppressed. That Auchon really hates me. He really hates me with every fiber of his being. Oh, man. Oh, I should have taken him down. I could have killed him if I hadn't fired my, wep my weapons against the wall and reloaded. I could have easily killed him, no problem. One kill. So he's down to last stand, finally. And now he gets another flight. And we're gonna battle in the meantime this guy here. I'm, you know what? I'm actually going to follow him out now. I'm following him out of the circle just to get him. You are not getting another flight ability. Forget it. It's over. You have had enough flight abilities as it is. Come on, leech me. Oh, he's not leeching. He's too good. Now he is. Okay. Making him lose his lock on. Boop. There you go. Lock on lost. Wait, why was I not doing damage? Huh? His leech ability was over and I wasn't doing any damage. That was weird. <laughs> not the best moment to drop your stealth, dude. I have all three ability charges ready. Oh my god, let me pass. Gee. Wow. How I was stuck there and I couldn't keep move around, around this wall. Ugh. With 50% more damage output, we should be able to have some fun with this guy. And in the meantime, this leech down there is lo losing his leech ability. This guy is missing most of his shots. Okay. Wow, look how much damage we've done. <laughs> this is really crazy. Uh, we could... No, since we're having more damage output ready right now. I'm wasting all his time. That's what we can do best with this thing here. Alright. Oh, hey, he can hit me here. Uh, but I'm just doing free damage right now. And then, at the last second, you'll see me just dropping in with my Titan 2. And saying bye-bye. And let's get that Falcon, because the others have a hard time getting that fi Falcon killed. Same goes for this Falcon. It has so much resistance that it would be very hard for for most setups to kill. kill. And now we have, okay, we have an Arthur underneath. By turning to me, he gets killed by everyone on the battlefield, dude. He turned to me and all others were shooting into his flank. Ah, that's good. Have you ever seen a Titan die that fast? Wow. These things are way overpowered, these weapons, in my opinion. And I, I will stand by that. I, will, I won't stop saying it. These weapons are too overpowered. It takes too long fire before they reload. They need to reload more often. The same long reload, but they need to have it much sooner. Um, but yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, that was the twenty, uh, the the, the two-hour long live stream. We have reached the end, and I think to take a like to draw a conclusion on uh, on this module here. Uh, I really love that. I think it's a great addition to the game, especially the way they work, right? You have to take some damage before you can really snipe well, but if you did and if you didn't manage if you managed to not die in the t process of taking that damage, you can do better then. So it's a high risk, high reward kind of playstyle, right? 
you need to take damage, but then you can do more. And, uh, and that can go wrong. And I like high risk, high reward. What I don't like is high reward, low risk. Like playstyle of leeches, playstyles of Ares back in the days, uh, playstyle of Scorpion, right? Jump in with resistance behind an enemy, kill him, teleport back if it's too hot for you. Low risk, high reward. That's not a really good playstyle, and I, I'd like to have always this... Uh, if something has the high potential of doing well and high damage and whatnot, then it should also have a high risk in playstyle where lots of things can go wrong. And you have to do it right. Right? But yeah, so... Um, Thank you guys all for being here. It's a pleasure to have you here with me. And also thanks for all the contributors here. My my lord, that was so many people here who we had today. Kursov, Vikjek, Vitek, where are the godlike sunglasses? I will find them for the next time. All right, man. Thank you, sir. And uh, until next time, have a good day and stay safe. Money signing off. Bye-bye. Speak German, people say. Hm, okay. Uh, ich wünsche euch allen einen geilen Abend. Habt Spaß, bleibt gesund und bis zum nächsten Mal. Ciao. <laughs> That was German.